Hey there! Have you ever struggled with speed ramping in CapCut? No worries, I am here with a quick tutorial to guide you through essential steps. So let's dive into the video. Okay, so now open the CapCut app and start a new project. Import the video clip you want to apply speed ramping to by tapping the plus button and selecting your video from your device gallery and now tap on add so here i already have the video in different parts but you can use the split button to make different sections of your video once you have done this select the portion of the clip between the split points by tapping on it then tap the speed icon in the toolbar at the bottom and select the option curve now here there are different options of speed but we will go with custom now click on edit and here you can adjust the speed of the selected portion to create a speed ramp, you will typically want to change the speed gradually. So now here, I want the slow motion in the middle of the video. So I increase the speed at the beginning and make it slow motion in the middle of the video. And then again, increase in speed at the end too. Okay, so now smooth slow motion is applying here. Play the video to preview the speed ramping effect. If it's not exactly how you want it, go back to the speed adjustment and fine tune the keyframes until you are satisfied. Now let's do the same process with all the clips here. Speed ramping in CapCut enhances your video editing by allowing smooth transitions between slow and fast motion, adding dynamic flair and storytelling impact. It offers precise control and a professional cinematic touch to your videos, elevating their visual appeal and engagement. Now the next step is to add transitions. So for this, create smoother transitions between the normal speed and the ramp speed. You can add transitions. Tap in between the two clips. So the transition open. There are so many transitions you can choose according to your preference. Okay, so in this quick tutorial, we start a new project and import the video. Drag the clip into the timeline. Locate the points where you want to apply speed ramping. Select the section between the split. Adjust the speed for each shape. Play the video to preview the effect and make adjustment. Add transition for smoother speed. Finally, export your edited video to save or share it. Once you are satisfied with the speed ramping effect and any other edits you have made, then simply export your video and share it. This is it for today's video. I hope you like it. If you have any question or confusion, comment down below. Subscribe to the channel for more interesting tutorials. Bye!